here you will see a problem from the topic permutations. Question is how many three digit even numbers can be made using the digits 1, 2, 3, 4, 6 and 7 if no digit is repeated. Okay? So, here we have to note that number should be even numbers. It means digit at units place should be even number. Total number of digits is here digits given 1, 2, 3, 4, 6 and 7. Okay? So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Correct? 6 digits are given and the number which we will form will be even number. Means digit at units place is here even number means digit at units place is even number ok. So, for solving this problem we will use the formula that we generally use in this chapter permutation the formula is NPR is equal to N factorial by n minus r whole factorial correct so first of all we need to understand that we have to form three digit numbers okay so we are having three places and this is units place so this number should be filled up by even numbers okay and how many even numbers we have here one two three even numbers so out of these three even numbers, we have to select any one number for this place, for units place. That can be selected in how many ways? 3, P, 1. Okay? Because we are having total even numbers is 3 and we have to select 1. So, N is equal to 3 and R is equal to 1. So, N, 3, 1. Okay? So, number of wage of selecting digit at units place how much 3 p 1 and let us calculate it 3 p 1 means 3 factorial by 3 minus 1 factorial 3 factorial by 2 factorial this is equal to 3 correct and remaining two places here we have and these two places will be filled by how many uh, with the help of how many digits we have here six digits and one digit has been used for this units place so remaining five digits we have and out of these five digits we have to select two digits for tens place and hundred place and we have to arrange them so we have to select two out of five so also number of wage of selecting two digits out of five four tens place and hundreds place hundreds place is equal to how much five p two remaining total digits is 5 out of the 6 we are we are using one even number that will not be repeated again so remaining is 5 here and out, out of this 5 we have to select 2 now let us calculate it this is equal to 5 factorial by 5 minus 2 factorial means 5 factorial by 3 factorial so this is equal to 5 into 4 this is equal to 20 so, one part of this job means forming a number has been done in 3 wage and rest part has been done in 20 wage. So, this entire job, this entire formation of 3 digit even numbers will be multiplication of 3 and 20 that is 60 that will be the answer. Therefore, number of 3 digit even numbers will be 3 into 20 this is equal to 60.
this is the answer okay so we should note here that if one part of the job has been done in m wage and rest of the part has been done in n wage then this entire job will be done in how many wage m into n wage so 3 into 20 wage that is 60 wage means 60 numbers are here that will be formed which will be even numbers okay so this is the solution solution is very simple very easy we can understand it very easily thank you very much thank you for watching this video